Hey, what's up, guys? Totally dubbed here, and today I'm flashing over uh, Faryab's unofficial AOKP. Uh, this is for the Samsung Galaxy S3. Uh, some might know it from the Galaxy S1 or even Galaxy S2. Uh, so um, the the installation is actually very simple. Uh, all we're gonna do is go into recovery. So obviously, you have to be uh, rooted and have recovery um, already uh, installed on your phone. At the moment I am on a custom ROM, which is Omega V7.0, which is based on LF5. So um, what we want to do is put on your in your internal SD card the two following files. It's the AOKP um, ROM and uh, GAPS, which is the Google app applications. So um, you need these two in your internal SD card. And once you've got them two, uh, you want to go into recovery. So to go into recovery, we're going to go up, home, and power after the phone switches off, i.e., now, and get into recovery. Once in recovery, what we're going to do is do a full wipe. So you don't have to do this if you're already on AOKP on the Galaxy S3, but seeing as I'm not, I'm going to have to wipe my phone. So first we're going to factory reset, wipe cache, and then we're going to go advanced, wipe Dalvik cache. There we go. Install zip from SD card, choose zip from internal SD card, as you saw I put it in the internal SD card, and find a ROM and flash that over. The, um, the ROM itself isn't too big, it's actually quite small, so um, it's around 200 odd meg megabytes, so that's, that's pretty good. Obviously I would suggest doing backups just in case, uh, for example an Android backup, um, and you can also do a, um, a titanium backup for your apps. Now we're going to flash over gaps. is for our Google applications like the Play Store, Google Maps and whatnot. Go back and we're going to reboot system now. So I think we're going to get the uh I don't know if we're going to get the unicorn or not. Ah there we go. <laughs> That's a pretty cool boot animation I've got to say. It's like a 3D-esque type boot animation. Looks pretty nice, I've got to say. Yeah, it's really nice. <laughs> right, it seems like the phone is just booting up right now. Any second now, it should just pop up. <laughs> I remember this video with unicorns. <laughs> on YouTube. <laughs> it's just a random one. <laughs> just remind me of that. Right, English United Kingdom. Not now. Next. 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 Finish. Right. So you got the two launchers. I'm going to go with the default launcher for the time being. So, the applications that we've got. Here they are. So you've got Nova Launcher, you've got Super User in there. So very light, very light ROM. As you can see, that's because of the size. Uh, let's go on Nova Launcher and see how it looks like. Looks pretty cool. Let's just use Nova Launcher for the time being. Go System Settings, About Phone, and here you go. Baseband, i.e. the modem, is LF2. AOKP like so and usually with AOKP yes we do have it we've got ROM control and it's quite useful for customizing your ROM the way you like it for example in general UI I can I don't know uh, have the CRT off animation as you can see and I can disable that and so now when I do it it doesn't have it so that's um, I re what I really liked about AOKP is these uh, these controls over here these quick links as so as they call it so uh, yeah there we go that's how the ROM looks like um, let's see what else is there da, da, da. 
there's anything else to show? I'm not quite sure. Here's the widgets. AOKP clock. ROM control. It seems very, very snappy, I've got to say. It's very fast, very responsive, so that's quite nice. I wonder how it'll do with battery life and whatnot. But as you can see, it's based on uh, ICS, so it's not um, touch widths. Uh, you haven't got the certain power options, for example, on touch widths. But uh, yeah, I'm going to try this ROM out for a couple of days, and uh, I'll let you guys know on... Um, um, how it how it goes how it goes on on my website so i hope you've enjoyed this uh, video please do rate comment and subscribe and uh, yeah hope you've enjoyed this installation video cheers guys totally dubbed out bye bye